the sky boy KK hot shot him he had a big ass boy <laughs> <laughs> What is going on, you reactionary martyrs and you hustlers out there? It's your man's A Track Brown. This is the PW Hustle. Drake put his big boy pants on and he decided to respond to J. Cole. Not J. Cole. Respond, he decided to respond to Kendrick Lamar. Now, J. Cole responded to Kendrick L Lamar and I should have did a reaction to that. I was gonna do a reaction, but I just said, ah. you know, when it comes to music, I, I don't, I don't even know how this video is gonna come out. You know, I don't with with the way they do things and the copyright restrictions and and what you have to do to get it through. I, I have no idea how this is gonna work work. But when I saw Johnny Odell do the compilation, I freaking kicked myself. I said, damn it, I should have reacted. I should have recorded my reaction because when I heard conductor, conductor, I fell out my chair, Mandalorian style. I scream! I jumped! I scream! I say, "Yeah!" Because <laughs> th that's how much I like Conductor Williams. Right now, Conductor Williams is is to me, he's the best producer right now. Right now, and I'm not saying overall. My my favorite producers overall is Premier, Jay Dilla, uh, uh, Mad Lib. I like him. I even like Kanye. Does he's on my list too? Um, my number one is 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 Premier. Premier is my favorite. But you also have New Jabez. May he rest in peace. As well as Jay Dilla. Um, I like Just Blaze. Um, so so I just I just I just felt like I missed out on the opportunity because 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 that reaction to the hearing that conductor y'all would have loved that. But so let's let's see what we have here. I don't think this is a conductor uh, Williams produced song anyway. So that doesn't matter. So let's see what Drake got for us. All right. I, I gotta be honest, I'm 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 not a Drake fan. So a lot of you might be like, well, you just said he's not a Drake fan, so he's might be hating. If I don't like this shit, I don't know what to tell y'all. I'm just not I'm an old school hip hop head, alright? So you gotta go in hard. No uh, no diddy. Alright? So you you I don't I uh uh you I don't I don't wanna hear no no ABC bubblegum hip hop rhymes. I don't. He better go in on this track. That's all I know. So let's see what he got here. Oh, like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button. Donate to the channel. Donate to the Cash App. By the way, if you want me to react to certain shows or movies, you got to donate. If you want me to do something specifically, you got to donate to the channel, all right? $15 for a series, $25 for a movie, and, you know, that's that's just the way that I'm doing this when it comes to people personally requesting things. I'm sorry. It's just the way that it is. But anyway. Uh, follow me on Twitter at track Brown, the number eight TRAC Brown. Do not forget that the PW Hustle is on TikTok at PW Hustle. If you are on Facebook, join the Hustle Fandom Group, okay? You can post your opinions about what's going on with this beef, and we can discuss it. So join the Hustle Fandom Group. Links will be in the description and in the comment section below. All right, so let's go. Here we go. Let's see how Drake, you know, let's see how Drake disses. Eh, 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 eh. Remember, push a D, push a D, push a T. 
destroyed this nigga. All right, he absolutely destroyed him. So if you can't fuck with Pusha T, you ain't fucking with with K Dot. That's just the way that it is. But let's let's hear it. Let's hear it. Let's let's be fair. Pause. So this is already produced by Who Kid. Okay. I'm assuming it's Who Kid. So he produced it, right? All right, here we go. I already don't like this beat. Pause. I don't like this beat. This, what the fuck is this? It, 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 this beat better drop at some point like that Ken, like that J. Cole beat because I wasn't feeling that beat until I heard Conductor. Conductor. So, it, 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 so far he gets an F on the beat. Hey, I could never be nobody number one fan. Your first number one, I had to put it in your hand. You pussy. Pause. Okay. Um, I could never be nobody number one fan. Your first number one, I had to do, I had to put it in your hand. Uh, Okay. Okay, he, 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 he's coming out like Clubber. He's already hitting it. He's already hitting, hitting hard. Uh, that's, a, that's a future reference. If I'm not mistaken, Future's number one song. Drake was on that joint, so I guess a lot of people will give credit to Drake for him for Future going number one. I'm not a Future fan. I don't even know more than 2% of that guy's music. So, um... Lyrically, he's garbage. So Drake dissing him like this don't really mean much, but it was still it, that was still pretty funny. But let's go. Here we go. Ooh, <laughs> I'm the hit maker y'all depend on. Back in my city, it was friend zone. So he's basically saying, he's basically saying, we all good when you want to make a song with me when you need that hit. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Okay, hi yellow. All right, let's go. Here we go. Take no chain off of us. How the fuck you be stepping with a size seven man zone? This the part with <laughs> Oh shit. Okay, um <laughs> How you pick stepping with a size seven man zone? Uh yeah, 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 see that in the back, right? Y'all see that, right? Kendrick, Mr. Morale, and a big stepper. <laughs> Kendrick is like, what, five foot, five foot five? <laughs> he said, how you big stepper with size seven men on? All right, that was funny. That was funny. That that was funny. Yeah, yeah. Because <laughs> he took the title of his album and <laughs> he applied it to his nigga where it's small ass. <laughs> he said, you got small ass feet. <laughs> All right, all right, okay. <laughs> that was funny. I ain't gonna lie. That was funny. Woo! All right, here we go. For us, how the fuck you be stepping with a size seven man zone? This the part with the bite, nigga. What's up? I know my picture on the wall when y'all cook up. Ex baby, hope for red, you been shook up. The stop so you drop and give me 50 likes of push ups. Last one brick, you really not on shit. They make excuses for you cause they hate to see me lit. Put your contract. Oh, uh, wait, 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 wait. Your last one bricked. You really not on shit. They make excuses for you cause they hate to see me lit. Okay. I think it's obvious he's talking about Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. Um, I really don't give a shit what any of you Drake fans have to say. Drake ain't got not one album that's better than Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers. At all. At all. Mr. Morale and the Big Step, you know, I, I've heard a few people talk about how they weren't, you know, big fans of that album or whatever. I don't know what kind of crack y'all smoking on. The, you know, the two, the, 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 the two for $5 shits, the blue tops, you know, I, I don't know. But Mr. Morale and the Big Steppers, fucking amazing. 
That was an amazing album. And there's nothing that Drake could say to try to play that. I mean, I guess you could go for the, the, the some of the people who weren't feeling it. And I guess those people weren't Kendrick fans to begin with. But uh, I thought Mr. Morale and Big Stepper was better than Damn. I like the theme of the album. I like the beats of the album. I like, it, like, come on, man, please. How are you going to try to act like that album ain't shit? Whatever. Let's go. Fail on that one. Here we go. Keep going. Maroon 5 need a verse. You better make it witty. Then we need a verse for the Swifties. Top say drop. You better drop and give them 50. Oh. oh, shit. He said, pimp squeak, pipe down. You ain't no big three. <laughs> he called him a pimp squeak. Oh, here we go. Let's go. Ooh, okay. I like that. I like that. Hold on, hold on. Let's not let's not go. Let's not. All right. Let's not skip that. You like your label boy, you in the scope now. And you're gonna feel the aftermath of what I write down. Okay. Now I can tell you right now. Kendrick is definitely going to say something off that line. Talking about what I write down. Nigga, you, you, you probably had a ghostwriter write this shit. But I do like those two lines on it. So far, he, he said some cool shit for, for, for dissing Kendrick and Future. So I give him props on that. By the way, this beat is not all of that. It's trash. What the fuck is this 20V1 nigga? What's a prince to a king? He a son nigga. Um, eh, C minus. C minus on that. <laughs> so he's, he's dissing Metro Boomin too now? Metro shut your whole ass up and make some drums nigga? Uh, Metro Boomin is whack so I, I don't... I, that, he's one of these rappers I don't like at all. Like, like Drake. But let's go. All right, all right, whoa, whoa, wait, wait, wait. He's losing me now. He's losing me now. This flow is not all that. This beat is complete trash. He's only said like three lines, three, three or four. He, uh, the, 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 the opening future line, the, the uh, size seven shit, the Metro booming disc. Uh, so that's three. So far, you know, I'm not, I'm not. Here we go. Ooh. Shit probably change if your baby mom starts to kiss and tell. Oh, so he's going after niggas' baby's moms here. So, okay. This didn't work out well for you last time, Drake. But let's go. I, I, again, I get this whole thing. Is, you know, it's it's like when 50 was dissing mad niggas or whatever. But the, the this chorus, why does he always have to do this? Like sing and, and, and whisper or whatever the hell he's doing here. This is why I can't stand this dude other than the fact that he's just a complete cornball and he's a fake. But, all right, here we go. Uh, okay. I'm going to take your latest girl and cuff her like I'm Ricky. Um, we all know you was begging Rihanna for the buns. We all know that you get buns that are leftovers. No. Uh-uh. You got to stop. You, 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 you. Uh uh, bro. All you do is chase niggas' leftovers, bro. Like, come on, man. 
You 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 can't be talking about taking nobody's girls. Here we go. Ooh, okay. I think all right. That's a, I think that's a Rick Ross. That's got to be Rick Ross because every now Rick Ross is another dude I don't like. I don't care for Rick Ross music at all. <laughs> but Drake got a point here. Every time Rick Ross has done something and, it, and it's charted well, it was because he was on a song with Drake, you know, or DJ Khaled or somebody. It, 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 all right, here we go. Did he just diss J. Cole? He just diss J. Cole. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go back, 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 go back. They said that dot shit was weak as fuck. Okay, um what? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Go back here. Money wise, I'm out here. You not fucking sneaking up. Corn, corn boy, your show money, merch money, feed to us. I'ma let niggas work it out because I seen enough. This ain't even everything I know. Don't even don't wake a demon up. Um, it's it, I can't. Nigga, you light skinned Canadian. Stop acting tough. You're not tough. Jesus. <laughs> I, I hate to say that, but let's go. Fuck niggas teaming up. Okay, the beat. Oh, oh, okay. What top five you smoking on, Kendrick? I right, and the beat change. All right, let, let, let's see. It ain't conductor style, but let's see where we going here. Of course, this nigga started singing again. Okay, yeah, nigga. All right, all right. You know what? Okay, so overall, what do I give that entire diss track? A motherfucking C minus. You know what? No, a C plus. <laughs> I, I get yes. No, a C. I give it a C because he started off cool, distant future. The way he did that, I like that. The 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 size seven shit that was good too. The the uh when he dissed Metro booming, I felt that. Along the lines, though, he start doing his usual Drake shit, going after, going after. Listen, reminding people that it was you, like you the reason why, um, you're the reason why, you know, these people got hits or whatever. That's 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 one hundred percent valid. You know, you got to bring that up. But hearing the, some of the other stuff he's saying and knowing how K Dot is, we talking about what I write and baby moms and this, that, and the third and taking girls. Kendrick is going to tear your ass apart. No diddy. He's going to tear you apart. So between Steph Curry being the executive producer of Netflix, that Good Time re, Good Times reboot crap, J Cole dropping J Cole dropping his diss and then apologizing. And now this pathetic attempt at acting like you got you got balls. Y'all making light skins hold major L's this year, man. <laughs> I kid, of course, but it's just funny. But yo, ah man, all right. Overall, I like I said, I gotta give this a C. I was I was I felt some lyrics, you know, some of the, some of the snaps that he put out was was cool, but overall. You know, even there may have been some stuff that, that might went over my head. I won't, I won't, I won't deny that. I'm not, I'm not familiar with everybody who's beefing. So my main thing was was Jake Cole and Kendrick. But I see how he came after everybody in this. Like again, again, like I guess you said, like Fifty did or whatever. But this, this isn't anything classic. 
I'm sorry. This isn't anything that people are going to remember again 20, down, 20, 20 years down the road. It's, it's just not. It's not Jay-Z versus Nas. It's not Common versus Cube. It's not Cube versus NWA. You know, this, nah, this isn't, this is, whenever, whenever Kendrick, whatever Kendrick drops, he's going to destroy this nigga. I, 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 I'm sorry. I was not feeling this like that. I was not. And Drake continues to unimpress me. It's just, it's just the nature of the beast. If you a Drake fan, then that's fine. But for me, this this shit was trash. <laughs> Maybe trash is too is too strong because if it was trash, I would have given an F. But this was not all of that. It was just not. It, it was weak. Can, it, you going after K Dot? Nah, bro. You gonna have to come harder than this. No Diddy. You gonna have to. Uh, uh-uh. uh. It's gonna have to be harder than this. It, it, uh, uh-uh. uh. Nope. It can't be like this. Kendrick. Kendrick is going to tear this nigga apart. Well, yo, let me know what you thought in the comment section. Like, comment, subscribe. Donate to the channel if you want. Donate to the Cash App if you want. Again, if you want me to react to something that you, you know, that you curious of how I would, you know, react to it or whatever, drop a donation. Uh, follow me on Twitter at HRAC Brown, the number eight TRAC Brown. Do not forget the PW Hustle is on TikTok at PW Hustle. And if you're on Facebook, join the Hustle Fandom Group. All right? Links will be in the description and in the comment section below. K Dot's gonna destroy this fool. Peace.